Hi everyone, this is Lorraine. So I wanted to show you a couple things that I've purchased recently. Um, I'm a fan of a company called Girlfriend Collective. They uh, make basically athletic wear. This set I'm wearing right now is one set that I just got from them um, in the green. The first items I ever purchased from them, which I absolutely love, so I'll just, I'll check on their website, but I'm gonna show you anyway because I think that they will obviously still have it. And it's like their little tennis skirt, skirt with the, under the shorts or underneath. So this is one of my favorite little sets that I own because you can basically get away with that wearing kind of workout clothes, but uh, you look a little bit more put together because you're wearing like a cute little skirt and it's just very, very flattering. Um, so I actually have this one, this set in black, but I also have it in there. It's like off white. It's not white, but it's off white. So this is the little skirt. And this is the top. I guess this is higher cut than I have on right now. For some reason I thought that it's the same as what I ended up getting recently, which I really like, but this one's a little bit higher. So this is the set. I'll wear this set in um, Friday's video. So if you're interested in seeing the little set on, it's super good. Um, and it really, it, it just makes you look like you're put together, but you don't have to try. And it just looks like a nice little outfit. And, the uh, fabric of the Girlfriend Collective is really nice. So I had that little set, so I ended up buying this set, which is in the green. And I also got the exact same, oh, I changed it up. I didn't even know that I changed it up. I got a slightly different top. So I guess I'm getting different tops. I got the blue pants also. These are the exact same pants um, but they're in the blue color. And I'll try to link everything below. But the fabric is just like, it's a nice, it's a nice stretchy fabric that kind of, it's a, it's a compression fabric. So it kind of sucks everything in pretty nicely. You still like won't suck in everything. It's not like Spanx where it's just like, but it's a nice compression, compression fabric. So it kind of tightens up the areas in the tummy and around and it just smooths everything out and looks great. That's why the little set with the shirt, the skirt is really nice. And then the top that I got, I didn't even realize how cute this was until I just, um, it's higher cut like my black one, but in the back, it's got a little crisscross. I'm a big fan of crisscrossing, especially when I get a little bit thinner and I don't have back fat, which I do right now, but we're getting it all toned up. Here's this top on. I really like it. I feel like it's just so good. So good. Pants, I left the pants on. I'm not changing them. The blue pants are exactly the same. But I just wanted to show you the top. I just really like that. Should I show you my black one too? I don't really want to take off my pants. <laughs> I'll just do the whole black outfit on um, Friday so then you can see the whole outfit will be super nice, but this blue, I'm just, I'm into it. I gotta get my nails done too, it's driving me nuts. This one, not good, and it just, it's overdue. But at least my nails have not broken, so that, there's that. But um, it's just, it's time to get the nails done and just haven't had the time. So here's hoping in the next couple days the other kids go back to school and then the time is there. Big fan of this company, um, just from the couple pieces that I own. So I get a lot of questions too about what bag I'm currently carrying. Um, I film like a little like glimpse into my life video. I haven't filmed a whole like day in the life type video like I want to, um, but I film like little clips of my life. Uh, so I've been doing that on my Instagram. Um, and I get tons of questions about my little purse. Uh, I just actually threw it in the washing machine. Um, if you ever want to know about how things wear and everything, uh, if you see me and I say I like something, I've thrown it in the washing machine. I don't ever buy anything that needs to be dry cleaned. Even if it says it's supposed to be dry cleaned, um, I'll throw it in the washing machine. And if it gets ruined, it gets ruined. Um, but anyway, I just threw this in the washing machine. This is my little bag. It's a Prada little re-edition bag. I really like it. It's just like a little crossbody bag that I can kind of just 
wear and it's super nice. It doesn't fit a whole lot, so it's just kind of convenient for day-to-day -day life where you don't need much, just need like your wallet and I don't know. That's basically all I carry in here is my wallet. Um, maybe I could fit my phone, but I have my phone on a whole strap by itself. Um, I have keys. Keys and my air tag and this just little crossbody bag, but I think it's a re-edition bag from Prada and I really like it. It's just nice and simple, but it's small. And it also had this little tiny container um, on it, but the little container, wherever it goes on here, clips on somewhere. It was constantly falling off. Oh, here's where the clip is. I feel like the clip is, I might have clipped it on wrong when I um, washed it, but whatever. It has a little clip and it had this little pouch and I have the pouch still, uh, but it kept falling off and my husband, <laughs> he he put it some, he put it inside another bag when he's like, it's just throw, just put it away. I'm like, okay, <laughs> put it away. Um, but like I mentioned, so this is the bag that I'm currently, you know, using all the time. It's great, um, get lots of compliments on it. I loved that I washed it and it looks pretty remarkable. The only thing with the Prada bags when you do put them in the washing machine or any bags in general, when you put them in the washing machine, you have to be careful because the liner, you know, sometimes the liner will rip. So I do have the liner is messed up on the inside. And don't mind my nails. I'm, uh, I need them done desperately, but uh, I've had children homesick for the last, this we're going on to week two. <laughs> uh, the youngest was sick with the stomach bug and now the two older ones have the stomach bug. So that's where we're at right now. Here's my wallet. I love that little bag. I think it's great. It's nice, um, but I plan on traveling soon and I needed something just a little bit larger. I still want to get crossbody. Um, something cute not anything crazy and i'm a fan of this company called mc wallace um, i have this tote by them which i just threw in the washing machine as well um and it's just nice if i were to get this again though like i like this one but it doesn't stay on my shoulder i would have gotten there's a version of this not the version i have but there's a version of this that has a strap attached to it, I would have gotten this version with the strap attached to it and I would have been super happy, um, but that's not what I bought. So I got this tote a while ago and I use it, but see how it just wants to come off the shoulder. It's, it's fine. I don't really use it that much anymore because I don't like that it's constantly falling off my shoulders. But when I need like a bag, it's got a zip on the top too. So if I need to zip off the top, that's always a convenient thing, but if you're gonna buy this, buy it with the strap that you can use it crossbody. So then if you're like going somewhere and you're like, you just can, you can strap it across you and it's great. So I have this tote, I like the fabric. I like that it's not as expensive as, um, as Prada, but it reminds me of that kind of nice fabric that seems kind of almost indestructible. You can get it dirty, you can wash it or whatever. So I ended up purchasing um, something larger, but crossbody, same company, MZ Wallace. And I'm gonna show it to you. So this is what it looks like. It's like a huge fanny pack almost, but I'm gonna wear it like this. So it's got the two zippers in the front. Now I can throw this all away since I'm showing it to you right now. And it's got all these concoctions. Let's see what we got going on here. We've got, okay. This is like if you wanna wear it as a fanny pack. We're not gonna be wearing it as a fanny pack. Then we've got the strap. And then this is the little decorative. See that we got the strap, okay, the strap. And then we've got this little decorative piece. I could be completely wrong. Could be telling you everything wrong. I think this is just completely decorative, very Chanel esque, but the price point is not Chanel. <laughs> the price point is decent, not anything crazy, but so 
there's that little I think that it really serves no purpose it just kind of is on there to you know look like you're so rock and roll so then I can just wear it like so I don't know if this serves a purpose I don't think this serves any kind of purpose it seems kind of long it seems a little long hmm hmm is there anywhere else I can attach it to because I don't know if I like that I've got to look at the picture online and see what they do but it's big enough that then I can put you know my wallet in it but some other things just a little bit bigger than my other one so and just price point good price point I don't feel like this is right doesn't this seem awfully wrong feels like it should attach to something else it just doesn't feel good it feels so wrong maybe it goes on to this it serves no purpose just put it, keep that one on there I don't know that it's supposed to but I strapped it up here and then I just put it down to the other one so that's where it's gonna go on me but that I feel like is nice because you can kind of just put the few things that you need for the day in here and that be it what do you think do we think that we should i gotta rip all these little papers off but do we think that we should just leave it up here or to hang it lower i feel like i want it hung across i don't think i want it hanging so low i don't think i'm into that but i feel like it's a good one for what it is and then it's got a pocket on the front as well so we've got pocket action some little silica beads in there i thought i saw another pack and then there's an inside there's an inside zipper pocket inside as well Ooh, with little pockets inside the zipper pocket two little pockets inside the zipper pocket so I think this is a good little purchase honestly I thought that it, I feel like I thought it was bigger than it is but I'm okay with this size gotta rip all this paper off kind of drives me nuts <laughs> it's kind of driving me nuts um, but yeah so that'll be my look you wear it on your back like a backpack if you want that's not my look but if I was a messenger, it has been lightened up my hair yesterday too, which I'm pretty happy about. Um, pretty happy about it. He was supposed to cut my hair yesterday too. He did not. He said he will on Friday. Um, but I have a lot of hair, so it takes quite a while. So he just, you know, colored it, washed it. We left, came home. Um, I let it air dry, and then I put some curls in it this morning. Um, but... I guess on Friday I shall be receiving a haircut probably nothing crazy I'll probably just take off some of the ends because I get like a yearly haircut <laughs> I was initially thinking I want to have short cute care cut but <sighs> this is where we're at and I like it you know right before you get your hair done is when you really start to like it like oh no I shouldn't do that because I really like it so that's where we're at right now. Those are my couple purchases. Um, I plan on filming a video on Friday. Uh, sick kids and all. Uh, but yeah, so if you have any questions, feel free to post them below. If you have any suggestions, post them below. Uh, but I just thought these were some cute things to share with you all for now. So I will see you all very soon with another video. Goodbye.